That's a bummer. I like that. There's nothing left of the head of that Phillips. Aggressive. It is a socket hammered onto a normal Phillips. Phillips head screw that's stripped out. No guarantees that this is going to work. Look at that! Didn't even break. You're my hero. Wow. That's the third time we've done this on this car now. What was that? So we're not sponsored by or affiliated with Craftsman, but they are uh, taking a beating. Noted. Literally. They're holding up. Toy. Trying to find spot welds on this battery tray. There's one right there. Hey, hey. One right there. Maybe one right there. Progress. <laughs> that is not OSHA approved. Okay, so that's too deep. Like all the way through. <laughs> well, we're gonna bolt it, right? That's a really big bolt, but yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. It was weird because the last brand wouldn't go all the way through. It would stop. I don't think the other ones down here are going to be as fun. There's a lot of rust in this corner. It's getting bigger. Oh my. Okay. Well. It's a little sad. Definitely some rust. But now that the battery tray's out, we might be able to repair that a little bit and clean up this battery tray or maybe build a new one. It's just for extra drainage. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh. So much rust. Trying to get this fender off and seeing just how bad the damage really is. <laughs> it's raining dirt. It's raining rust. Ooh. Nasty. Don't know what that holds, but maybe the fender. Oh yeah. Yeah, that holds the fender. Oh my gosh. Those are pieces of Bender. We're just trying to get a screw out here, and we're losing. <laughs> we're losing fender. part of the fender. <laughs> well, that rust hole we weren't worried about Ooh. has gotten a lot bigger. Probably for moisture trapped behind the trim. That fancy trim there. Yep. I didn't or want that anyways. If we bolt it back up, <laughs> it's almost fixed. What? No. <laughs> huh. For now. Fixed? For now. Not fixed. <laughs> fixed. Hmm. Yikes. Oh. Look at that. You're awesome. That's so cool. And she's been fighting it for a while. I have testing my patience. 
patience. It's only midnight. Hey! hey. Would you look at that? And <laughs> this even fit a here. speed hole. <laughs> That's for yeah. venting. Yeah. <laughs> so we got the fenders pulled, the headlight housings, and she's stripped. But we need to get it outside so we can pressure wash. So Nick had this great idea. We're gonna use a little <laughs> pressure lawnmower. We're gonna use a lawnmower with a ratchet strap. <laughs> I really hope this works. <laughs> We're in here on a Harbor Freight shop stool. The inside is totally gutted. And Nick's hooking up the lawnmower to the Z. And we're gonna pull it in the front yard to pressure wash. First run the Z. Ready? Oh, this might just work. <laughs> we're moving. <laughs> You're burning out. Oh no. Oh, no traction. <laughs> go, 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 go. Just finished pressure washing the fenders. They were really nasty. Full of more dirt and fine needles. Hit the battery tray for cleaning. And we thought there was more battery tray than there actually is because it's being held up. Supported. By the undercoating. Now I'm really nervous. Hmm. Good thing I know a welder. Hmm. And a designer to design a new one. Hmm. Gotta get all that out of the way. How's that going? Um, it's all right. <laughs> I really like your face, so you probably shouldn't stand there. Mm. You're probably gonna do a spark. So, surgery went well, but it's going to continue. We found out the firewall fell out. There's holes all the way up and down. Here they are. So now what? Keep cutting. <laughs> so Nick's going to cut some more. Wait, is that a Makita? Can we paint it red? <laughs> you can do it. Okay. Yeah, that's that's the heater. That's the blower motor bracket. You don't cut that. <laughs> At least it's metal so we can weld it. <laughs> yep, you, you, you sure got it. <laughs> you know, maybe we just don't need that belt. It hey. moved. <laughs> oh, 
Oh gosh, you can see the whole line of them. Jeez. Swiss cheese. Swiss cheese steel. Yep. We got a little carried away. Now you can see through the fender and into the cab. Nick was the voice of reason on this because I was very upset about it. We'll see how this patch goes. <laughs>